When I imagined what was about to happen, I immediately tensed up and prepared myself. But... Goku. <laughs> <laughs> we stood there for five minutes, then Kakarot appeared. Kakarot. Oh, she's about to drop another bombshell. She's about to be like, your dick's small. I'm not the only one without an alibi. Makoto's explanation is still insufficient. I'm sorry. What? Huh? I'm listening. <laughs> All it would take is covering the body with a certain something to keep it from getting wet. The tarp. Wait, you're gonna answer this? Yeah, I'm Dog. gonna fucking like, yeah, the tarp. <laughs> Don't it was me. <laughs> Don't implicate yourself. Shut up. Uh, your your <laughs> honor, my lawyer says I can't say this word. <laughs> It's like OJ Simpson when he fucking put on the put on the glove. He's like, no, actually, if I undo the strap, the glove does fit. <laughs> That's the equivalent of what I'm doing right now. Makoto's gonna like, like get her convicted, and then he's gonna write a book later saying I did it. <laughs> <laughs> Voting time. Voting time. What do you mean? The presidential election's not till November twentieth. <laughs> <laughs> What the f I'm not gonna live that. <laughs> <laughs> Head first, dog. <laughs> What's worse, getting crushed or falling to your death? Huh? Huh? <laughs> that was a long fall. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Dangarampa. Last time, we got the bad ending. And then we got the... Pro probably canon ending, but I also figured out where the joke came from. Operation Seaman and Seven Nation. If you watched our Lego Star Wars series back on my channel, <laughs> we've plugged the we... Lego Star Wars series. So <laughs> yeah. We them. impregnated the Death Star. That was one of the things that we did, and then we did it a second time where we impregnated Death Star too. It was Operation Seaman and Seven Nation, and I knew I wasn't just making that shit up, and I knew it was with 188. Who made the joke? It Who was, the it was me, because the fucking targeting computer looked like sperm going into an egg. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Operation Artificial Insemination. Yeah. Oh, and I apologize to everybody who wants heavy commentation during the class trials. This, at least for me on my end, Tosi really has been carrying it with both reactions and jokes. It's because I'm also incredibly invested because this is my first time playing through the class trials. So I apologize to everybody if I'm not able to make like crazy ass jokes and stuff like that. However, it's enjoyable as fuck. And so yeah, yeah, we're having me, a great time. I, yeah, no, I'm having a great time. And a, a lot of times, like when I'm reading a book or something like that, like imagine this. You guys have been to movies, right? If there was one guy who was watching the movie and you're watching the movie and stuff like that and he starts fucking talking over it, you're going to hate that fucking guy, right? That's me. I'm the one that's just watching and laser focused. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm the watching. guy you hate. <laughs> no, I'm, no, no, I'm the fucker either. that's talking <laughs> over me like, yo, what, guys, did you see that part? They totally like made a reference <laughs> to like 30 <laughs> minutes ago. <laughs> I realize I realize how that fucking sounds. But what I meant to say is like usually when you're into something or when you're focused on something, you don't really focus on like, you know, uh, the outside of it and stuff like that or like focus on making other commentary and and things like that you kind of yeah. sort of have to be like in 50 you just in other words also, for those of you who don't do commentary you have to split your brain 50 50 between commentating mm -hmm. and also paying attention and to what's, going, out what's on. going on this whole game is also extremely plot heavy anyway so 90 percent of the time we're focusing on the plot i obviously know what's happening here and there but so i'm trying to help guide him along uh but where was i going with this where was I going with this? But I hate one of these, and I'm never doing another guy. thing with them. <laughs> <laughs> No, I was going to go somewhere about um, the whole dialogue thing. So I can't remember. Just know it was really important, and it probably doesn't matter anymore. We're going to continue. Um, if I remember what I was talking about, I'll probably bring it up later. That's kind of my point. Maybe that was my point, that we're focused on the game a lot. So we're not going to be making, yeah. like... We're gonna make funny jokes here and here, but this is again, this whole series uh, is is not the typical 188 content where it's like it's not heavily edited. You, you already, if you're here at this, at this point, if you're here, you know that. Thank you. You already know Fucking that. Thanks. Type four in the chat if you're here still. <laughs> Type four in the comments <laughs> dude, in the comments comment below. It's gonna look like nothing but four. Oh, I know. That's I remember what I was gonna say. Joke. In a lot of the episodes, we record this in large sessions of like eight hours, so we run out of energy. 
uh, pretty quickly over long course of, so if like some episodes were like low energy, it's probably because we're towards the end of our session. Um, that's, and, and not only that, that's but it's thing. fun every single time. Like we'll push oh, yeah. our limits a little bit further because of how much, because I enjoy it. Like whenever me and Tosi get off, we usually talk about it and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. um, I watched a couple of episodes of the anime actually with yeah. Tosi just because I kind of started Don't worry, this up. I was curating it to make sure we didn't get spoiled or he didn't get spoiled. Yeah. Um, and after spoiled, we so finish this game, game, we're actually going to be watching the entire series. Um, like, well, eh, I'm still debating on that because Dangarapa 2 has, yeah, I, I don't know. Dangarapa 2 probably is best enjoyed without watching the other parts of the anime. We'll, we'll, we'll slowly introduce them to it. If you're a Dangarapa fan, you know what I'm talking about. Um, but, you know, regardless, that's what we're here for. Let's uh continue. Yeah, for sure. Oh shit, I'm the fucking driver. What the oh, hell God. is going on? <laughs> Calm down. It's okay. We're not the ones to be we're not the ones being trapped this time. Huh? Huh? In other words. Now it's the mastermind that that's ensnared. I could not read that word. What did you say? What are you talking about? So You'll understand soon enough. Very soon indeed. Massive high school towers. Wait, what the? Where the fuck am I? Why is free time? We're at the beginning playing? of the game, I think. That's high school towers all over the other buildings, the bustling urban area. It's like the school stands. Guys, this is episode one. Welcome, welcome world. to Danganronpa. Uh, so this is a visual novel game. And my microphone was fucking peaking like hell. Yeah, I don't know if you guys uh, have ever seen of this game, but this is me and 188's first time playing hey, through it. Yeah. Uh, so, well, look, <laughs> so, so that's the school, right? Well, yeah, I is think that, that's the that that school? school. You know, let's let's figure Home's out who this Academy. character is. <laughs> It's a joke that I make. Oh, remember that slippy fall oh, down girl? Oh, the <laughs> Joker! Yeah, <laughs> we're oh, yeah, joking all over the school. Oh, yeah. so what you was here, yeah, I remember very, alive. very well. What was the headmaster? Like, Dude, hey. what? If, okay, actually, what if I actually did that? What if I gave Monokuma Wato's voice <laughs> during Dude, the entire only be able series? To we would only be able to record like forty-minute <laughs> sessions because that voice destroys. Yeah, you know, it's what the. Anyway, I'm just gonna skip through all this, let them read it. But, like, there are two things you need to attend a school. You have to have already been attending high school, blah, 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 blah. Basically, this Yeah, this is actually the just thing. the start of the this game again. Showed me. Yeah. What if it made you play through everything all over again? <laughs> uh oh. Koto. <laughs> Shit! I just jumped all over this desk! <laughs> Wait, what? Where am I? I woke up with my head resting on the top of a hard wooden desk. My body felt. I don't remember this as part of it. It wouldn't be weird no, for me this to is, zonk this off. No, this definitely happened. Remember yeah, the, that? This definitely happened. Because he was drooling all over the desk, but it, we made like a joke that it was a semen. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Operation Insemination Proclamation. Proclamation Insemination. <laughs> yeah. Yo. Finally. Do you see that? Finally. I could finally feel. Wait, see what? Mm -hmm. What's like the most I obvious them. fucking thing in the in the frame right now? Well, I see Monokuma if that's what you're talking about. Yeah, is but that is that not familiar? Is that not familiar to you? You've seen that before. Hey, keep going, you'll remember. Did I check off to it? <laughs> what is it? What is it from? You'll remember. Me if you haven't pieced it together yet, I'll tell you later. I'll tell you if before you leave the area. Okay. I finally feel my mind and his body start to come back together and then I was awake. Or was it just another dream? A dream inside a hopeless nightmare. No, this isn't a dream. I could tell because the stench invaded my nostrils was too powerful a dream. An awful what smell. an awful smell. There was a vast dark cavern with the barest hint of light seeping in. Trash was piled high all across the area. This must be some kind of underground garbage pit. The heck of a situation to find myself in. I lived this apparently. 60 foot fall, landed on my head, and a desk was fucking above me, so there's a chance that it could just crush me from I, my I chin. The, but that's I, okay. I think the metal, like, what is it, two by fours or I beams broke your fall. <laughs> yeah, dude, yeah, because that's, everyone knows that if you have the option to land on a fucking rebar, you know, you <laughs> yeah. really want to land on fucking that. Just chalk it up to luck. Yeah, just chalk it up to luck. Uh, uh, my, uh, 
fall damage procced to where I don't have to like uh, Makoto you know, roll. Take fall damage. Mak Makoto actually has like a d20 on him. When he was falling, he rolled, a, he rolled, he rolled a d20 on dexterity. <laughs> he rolled yeah. it on saving throw, and he fucking got a nat 20. He basically floated down, you know. <laughs> Yeah, he had like a weird like glitch, you know, like reality itself had to glitch to save him for luck. He just like kind of sort of glitched up. It stopped his momentum and he just fell like an inch down to the ground. He lived. Yeah, you know that thing where like in some games where you can like jump again before you hit the ground and it, it like saves all your momentum. And, like, <laughs> Elden <laughs> Ring. Yeah. Elden Ring should fucking do that, dude. No. So you have a horse that could double jump, right? So you could jump off a cliff. Your horse double jumps right before it dies. So it has that enough upward momentum and it still fucking dies. It makes no fucking sense for sure. <laughs> Was I going to be stuck here while I wasted away and died? No, I can't let that happen. Not after what my good friend went through to save me. Oh, oh, uh, what's his name? So I remembered now. all too well what happened. Oh, Chihiro. Wait, what happened? Oh, yeah, oh, Alter Ego saved me. Good job, yeah, so, Chihiro. So, and he used I'm guessing that his luck actually procced here. Because it didn't have. Probably. He, cl clearly, Alter Ego didn't give a shit about Ch uh, Ch Kyoko. <laughs> like, well, that's not canon, though. So yeah, it's not canon, it but he, honestly, yeah, I'll, I'll let you know later. I'll let you know what, later. With what? It, it's sooner rather than later. You'll see in like ten minutes. I'll let you know within ten minutes. Okay. So I can't give up now, for myself and for my friend. And with that, my pursuit of survival begins. We're just looking for a way out of here. I don't yeah, want to see what this click is. That. What is that? You know what that is. I can't. Is that? It's a ro oh, it's from the opening when fucking he got sent to the rock and flew away, right? Yeah. Is that it? I was thinking that that was it, but I was like, it doesn't look like a rocket. Yeah, I mean, you got it. There you go. I don't have to sell you anything. Would that be from another game? Was that like a hint to another game, or is that fucking? No, like that, that happened. That was student? before the events. That was before you like were at school. You know what I mean? Oh, or, like, so I'm on the fucking yeah. moon. <laughs> is no, that no. What trying it to was say? before you controlled your started controlling your character. The rocket yeah, know, was it, from the intro where that guy got blasted off in the space and turned into a skeleton. Oh yeah, he did die. And then that's just a fucking tank. <laughs> yeah, that, there's no getting around that. Monokuma <laughs> has fucking military hardware. Yeah. <laughs> that is just like. <laughs> I shouldn't mean, have given up. it's like a shitty tank, but it's a tank nonetheless. If I was an Abrams, I'd be worried. This Wait. desk broke my fall. <laughs> this desk did. Dude, that, basically that did say really that. proves that you fell head first. <laughs> oh yeah. my god! Is that an airplane? Fuck. That's Wait, that is that like a P-50 or a P-51? Like, what is... Also, what would you do in this scenario if you were alone I'd, like I'd this? I'd be dead. <laughs> I fell on I, my I, neck me, bro. and broke my, no my, elf, bro. like, my whole entire spinal column compressed. See, you would die. I was mewing, all right? So I no, had that I, strong jawline that absorbed it, a lot of the shock. Honestly, you know what I'd do? I'd roll right before I hit the ground. <laughs> Honestly, I, like if I was, I did that same. Th this is not my joke. I, I think one of my friends said this joke before. But if I was ever in a plane crash, right before the, it crashed, I would just jump up, and that like would negate all of my fall just damage. Jump. Wait, Diego said that. Yeah. <laughs> I remember that. Yeah, Diego said that. Yeah. He was like, yeah, he was all like, he was all like, was like if you're in a plane, if you're ever gonna be in a plane crash, why don't you just like jump out the window at the last second and just like fall five feet instead of five hundred? <laughs> Some <laughs> shit like that. That's so true. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> He's smart. Diego's smart. He d he does that thing where he's smart. He can think pretty pretty well. <laughs> he can think. He be he do be having a brain. Yeah. That, that do be the type of sort of stuff that he have. It's locked. Rattle rattle. And if only you had no a matter key. how many times I pushed or pulled or kicked, it didn't bulge. Getting out of here isn't gonna be that easy. Well, if I'm not getting out of here anytime soon, I decided to look around for some food. There's plenty of food here, but it's all rotten. But that was pointless too. You can still eat rotten food. I, next, I search for some water. How can I sure which liquids I can drink and which ones are all around bad idea? Wait, Probably by not, the smell. Are you not standing in like standing water right now? Or is that the floor? Is that just like the I'm, floor texture? I think it's the floor texture. I thought I thought this room it's, was like a. You know what? You know why I'm thinking that? Because the garbage chute from Star Wars. 
like the cra the trash compactor had mm -hmm. water. Mm -hmm. I'm thinking like mm -hmm. there's gonna be a creature swimming around, pots a little head up. <laughs> Better give me a head under the water. Oh, like, good. What was that? I don't know. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> After making that proud declaration, the next thing I decided to do was cry. Jelk. Go I jelked. I sleep. And then I slept it was in that deep order. And uninterrupted. And I jelked again. Damn. Then I woke up. That was my only way to preserve what little strength I had left after not being able to eat or drink. I can't be sure, but I think at least a full day had passed. You know what I realize now? Kyoko knew that I didn't fucking do it, but she still wanted to pass blame onto me because she knew that the fucking like Monokuma or sorry, the headmaster did it. Well, yeah. And Kyoko, um, the reason why she passed it on you is because she thought she was going to have more time to tell everyone because Monokuma cut everyone off. Like, the second the blame yeah. was passed back to you, he's like, all right, class trial's over. No more. All I did was sleep, sleep. It was like I was waiting for some kind of sign come falling out of the sky. Wow. Guess what? That's really, that's literally going to fucking happen. You know what I think right now? And this is going to be absolutely fucking crazy. All right. Kyoko is going to throw the mastermind key. And that's how I'm going to fucking oh, get out of the here. the fucking skeleton yeah. key. Watch. Watch. It's going to happen. What fell from the side wasn't a sign. Not a oh, my God. I'm going to throw my fucking monitor through the roof. I swear on everything. The crunch. What the? Straight sound pierced my silent, isolated, jarring me awake. I also watched a pile of garbage jostle in the form of an odd shape. Did something fall down over there? Something fell up from above. What could it have been? <sighs> Wait, are they saying the trash Damn. broke your fall? No. Wait, was that no, always there? Like, this is, no, this is new. This is all new. The fuck? Watch, it's gonna be like the keys here. A giant piece of trash just fell down here. I carefully stretched my hand out toward whatever those that tumbled down here with me. Just a second. A giant piece of trash? Rude. Okay. Go oh, it's Kyoko. Going back, this is what I was saying. With uh, in, when we're, when Chihiro's on screen or Alter Ego. I was gonna say they both end up down here anyway, and they, like if they wanted to go with the non like the other route where you pick pursue the lie, they could have just had Kyoko end up down here, and then you come down here, like and reverse the roles. That's what I was gonna say, um, but I didn't want to spoil this. But oh, yeah. but they just they oh, chose okay. to go the fucking weirdest route and have Asahina get smells... pegged by like like all three dudes and and, and have three ch children. It, it was weird. No, no more. Yeah, right. It was so fucking weird, bro. They all shared. They all double dip yeah, in the uh, pudding. Don't you don't such double a, dip in such homies' such pudding, a bro. Weird, such a if weird If there's ending. anyone out here, if there's anyone out here who's double dipping on a girl, I gotta ask yourself why. <laughs> you gotta ask yourself what what makes you allow you to do that. You know, it's it's grody. It's nasty. And then the then nasty. Makoto to triple dip, man. Like, have you no respect? I triple no dip, bro. Honestly, if there's some wings on the table, right? You dip once, you chew once, you finish that damn wing. You do not fucking after with your slobbery fucking cock. <laughs> don't put your cock sauce, in the honey okay? mustard sauce, you fucking gross ass. You don't put your cock back in person. the honey mustard sauce. That's bad. This All place right. smells awful. This place also, smells that's my awful. favorite fucking image. It covers up her butt head. She looks more attractive like that, I'm going to be honest. Kyoko. Oh, you look like you are doing better than I expected. How do you like my battle pass skin? I just got it. I have cup noodles it's, on my head. I'm, I'm referencing Bastion Ramen right now. Uh, canonically, I fucking... Ramen Bastion. I fucking decorated from Overwatch. So... Anyway, isn't it obvious? I'm here to help you. I'm glad to hear that, Kyoko. Um, you've got a bit of garbage in your hair. She ever had a quick, sharp shake to I get rid of trash. I hope they keep the, the ramen uh, swirl in her hair. Hey. Damn it. First, I have something for you. Go ahead and eat it. We can talk once we're you're finished. That's a interesting uh, oh, image of the you. water bottle and the two buns. Yeah, whoever put that one is really funny. That's the bread and the water that the she was holding. The joke is, it's a me. peanut. I'm sorry. <laughs> it was in my mouth. <laughs> no, <laughs> no, I was saying like the the buns, the buns in the water. You could. I know, <laughs> I know, I know, I know. But it's funny because the next thing that I say oh. within seconds, it was in my mouth and making its way towards my stomach, which is also an innuendo. That's true. 
Sorry, I ruined oh, the joke. Really Shoot. <laughs> Shoot. Makoto, you ruined my fucking joke. Shoot. <laughs> That's wrong. <laughs> now I've got all the energy I need to keep going. So you still haven't given up then? Of course not. After all, the fact that I can keep for going forward is all is all is about all I'm good at. Well, that's not such a bad thing to be good at, I guess. All right, Kyoko. So you and I are trapped down here, here in the garbage. We're gonna be plowing right on those stairs. But Kyoko, but oh, that's not you. <laughs> you wanna you wanna finish that? Why'd one I too? come to rescue you? You know what, let's just switch roles for this one. Mm -hmm. Well, you be Makoto and I'll be her, because I, I want to try out my girl voice. All right, fine. So, to pay a debt. Nope, all right, we're, we're done here. No, no, no fuck it. No, <laughs> we're shut done up. here. This is, this is Kyoko currently. I landed on my voice box. I fucked it up a little bit. Or, no. Do a ton. Do more. No, go back. Go back. Go back. Okay. So do more what I do to pay a debt. Or no. To a tone. Lower to your voice. Or no. To a tone. Because, like... Hina. Hina's like that. Hey, I'm Hina. I'm fucking okay. annoying and high pitch. <laughs> right? But Kyoko is more no. like to mysterious. Level headed. Okay. All right. Pay a debt go. or no. To right, a tone. Mysterious. 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 I got it. A tone. <laughs> During the trial. <laughs> Sora. During the trial. <laughs> even though you knew I was right. lying. <laughs> yup. This is how I do it. During the trial. Even though you knew I was lying. You didn't say anything. I hate it. I'm sorry, I hate it. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. Continue. I, no, Do I want to be Kyoko. No. Oh, no. Put me back. Put me back <laughs> in. I don't want to be Makoto. Fuck this kid. <laughs> Give me two more lines. Give me two more lines. So you knew that I knew? Well. Oh, you want to fuck up my character? Yeah, I'm going to. Even though I do, I did nothing to help you. <laughs> I abandoned you. <laughs> Don't say that! You didn't abandon me! Yeah! That's exactly what I did. I abandoned you in order to save my own life. You were trying to save me and I couldn't bring right, myself to this two lines are up. I can't listen to this. However, but listen, but listen no, that's not what I'm trying no, to make. <laughs> cannot listen to this anymore. <laughs> Take your fucking we'll shitty character back. But listen. But listen, that's fucking, not, not what I'm Not that I'm- I'm gonna mute you. I'm gonna mute you. <laughs> <laughs> To your let's play, I'm not gonna mute you. <laughs> but this listen, fucking, not for that, the rest of the time. Not that I'm trying to make any excuses, but there was a reason that I had to survive, no matter the cost. I can't offer you any reason other than that. I'm. I'm really sorry. I'm so I. I abandoned you in order to save my own life. But listen, that's not what I'm trying to say. There was a reason I had to survive, no matter the cost. What did you have to Gosh, what, why, why did, did you, you have, have to survive, survive Sora? <laughs> I'll, tell I'll tell you. you. I'll tell you everything. I'll tell you everything. <laughs> the reason Please I have to survive is, is so that I could do what I came to do at this Clean school. The hearts. No, uh, <laughs> it's so that I can do what I came to the school to do. What? I made up my mind to come to Hope's Peak for very one important, very re one re. <laughs> I'm going to tell you everything. The very important reason I made up my mind to come to Hope Speaks Academy. Gosh! <laughs> Just get cut off. <laughs> so you have some reason for coming to Hope Speak. Indeed. Ah, that's right. At least I did. Once. Jealous. I want some water. Once. Hi. Until recently, I had forgotten what it was. You forgot? But that's... I had no memory of what my purpose was. No memory? That's impossible. Amnesia! Yeah. Say it. Ellipses. Ellipses? <laughs> Ellipses! <laughs> then... It's really true? You lost Makoto. your memory? Do you remember, M Makoto? The 21st night of September. I was she there. starts dancing while unbreaking eye contact. Do you remember the first thing that happened to each, us, each of us as soon as we arrived at the school? The first thing? You're talking about when we fainted, right? I fainted and then I woke up. I was trapped here. That's Let me close right. my window. I fainted too. And when I woke up... One second. 
Just wow. Turn the audience white cloak way to keep a girl waiting, Makoto. You know what? I'm changing this line. I farted too. And when I woke up, I farted again. Look at my purple eyes. They're like actually more of a lavender now that I'm that I'm realizing. And I have like a purple. Thank God you have jacket. me along for the fucking pink, <laughs> this pink fucking hair. Way. <laughs> and uh you know, normally I don't make small talk, but I notice a strange feeling of separation cool. within good, myself. Good, good fucking, that was good a shit. Disconnect. Was good. good way to like See? follow it up. Thinking back on it now, at this point, my memory was gone. At that time, I'd forgotten. I couldn't remember why I'd come to the school, and why I couldn't remember what my ultimate ability was. But... But... What would make you... <laughs> yeah, go ahead. You wanna switch voices again? I love you. But... Let's switch voices. But... 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 <laughs> Makoto just points, but... Points at her fucking head. <laughs> Strange, isn't it? It's hard to imagine it happened by chance. It seems much too convenient. Are you saying you think you lost your memory because... I don't think. I'm positive it was the work of the mastermind. They stole my memory. But why would Th they want to do that? There's only there's one only... reason I can come up with. Because of my purpose, my ability, somehow they would interfere with the mastermind's plans. So the masterminds just stole them from However, you? And it could also mean somehow my memories may be connected to the mystery of the school and the mastermind. Which is why I have to get them back. This why that's why I have been investigating things by myself this whole time. But if you want but, to, if, <laughs> it, it, but if what you say is true. But, yeah, but <laughs> help you. Why that? <laughs> <laughs> if I did that, and we all worked together as one, the mastermind would have noticed right away. Plus, sorry, <laughs> there's, there's all. I got distracted, I started thinking about butts. There's also the chance that the mastermind is actually one of us. It says butt again? What? But, what? well, don't make my butt such a big deal of it. It's just a possibility. That was hot. Say that again, Toasty. But since it's a possibility, we can't ignore it, right? Oh god. Oh goodness. The mastermind. One of us. If she believed that, then of course she wouldn't trust anyone around her. In which case, it only makes sense that she would look into her missing her memory by However, herself. That being said, there was a limit to what I could do by myself. Which is why I asked you to help me. But... Why <laughs> but, me? <laughs> because among you... But, among everyone, I don't know, oh my god, my dyslexia. Among everyone, you were at least le least likely to be the mastermind. That was just intuition, but... No. Shaggy is the least likely to be the fucking mastermind. <laughs> I'd, I'd argue he's the most likely with how stupid he is. <laughs> how Dude, dumb he's playing. That, Kyoko's fucking... a ghost? Prove to me the dead body's not Kyoko! <laughs> yeah, like, come on, dude. That's the man. Clearly, that's the person who could, like, <laughs> switch everything around. He's the mastermind. I see. Your intuition was right, though. There's no way an ordinary kid like me could have been the mastermind. I'm no ordinary kid on Ben 10. What? I've got superpowers! <laughs> I'm sorry. This is like... Fuck. Dude, this is like another, like, one of those plot moments. I appreciate your fucking commentary because, like, I'm like, what is he about to say? I'm getting super power. I'm the ordinary kid on Ben 10. <laughs> <laughs> understand everything. Just w Makoto just whips out his Omnitrix, <laughs> turns into Diamond Head, and just fucking kills whips the and bear. Whips fucking turns into the ultimate life form. <laughs> he turns into Alien X. Yeah. <laughs> the goal isn't to get out of here. It's to stay here. I'm Ben 10. It's just like that dream I had before, but why did that just happen? Are you okay? Oh, yeah, it's nothing. It, it is nothing, right? Hey, even now, I still trust you, you know? You know who I miss? I miss Sakura. Who? Anyway, it's just I'm not used to relying on others. I miss... I miss... I miss actually, you know what? That's a good thing. Who do you miss the most out of everybody? Mondo. I miss Mondo mine's probably the most. Gonna be, mine's probably gonna be Taka. I miss Taka the most. Damn, we miss our favorite buddies. They're like the best friend club. Yeah, like that's best like friends. you and I. 
Who do you think you are? You're probably definitely Taka. I'm way more Mondo. <laughs> I'm Chikyo. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, let's go. <laughs> I, I forgot about Chihiro. If we were to give assign everybody, would you be, would be Chihiro. She would kind of be in the friend group. Yeah, she would be in the friend group, and also she's a guy. I'm sorry, and I he also would be in the friend group. The... I forgot that was already revealed. Who's Diego? <laughs> Man, I'm gonna switch my answer. <laughs> Diego <laughs> Chihiro. <That's okay. laughs> I'm Matakuma. <laughs> <laughs> I'm okay with I'm okay with Swagger being uh, Chihiro, or you being Chihiro. Um, <laughs> Who's Diego? Diego? Diego's like Mondo or something. No, you're Mondo. No, yeah, you're Mondo. Uh, um, I could <sighs> without wanting to put myself as the protagonist. Protagonist. I feel like Makoto's probably like the most suited towards me. Nah, you Chihiro. <laughs> Because Chihiro's really good with computers, and out of everybody on the group, you're the best with the computers. Well, I Let's can't be honest program here. a fucking AI that can save. That doesn't matter. All right. That doesn't matter. When anyone has his tech Just support problem, because I wore pre example, programming socks example, once doesn't mean I'm a outfit, cute femboy. And the maid outfit that I saw you in, that I keep a, a picture of under my bed. One hundred percent. It's not true, guys. The, He's for doctored image. He's doctored an image. It's not a doctored image. He's used bro. AI technology. technology. Anyway, it was taken with that fucking photograph shit that Katy Perry has. Yeah, anyway. Lady Gaga. Anyway. Anyway. Moving on. Moving yeah. on. Let's move on. Okay, we're moving on. It's just that I'm not used to relying on others. I know I never asked you for help the right way, so I understand if you're not convinced. Honestly, I was convinced. I think it's just her personality. Wow, it's gonna make me fucking play the game again. Click me. <laughs> Click the only so thing in the room. You said you had a reason for doing all the investigating on your own. So how'd that turn out? Were you able to remember so, anything? I think there's still a lot I don't remember. But at the very least, I was finally able to recall my purpose. My ability. Oh, this is the moment. This I've got moment. superpowers. I'm the ordinary kid. I'm Ben 10. Do you see this? Wham. Do you see this, Makoto? This is the Omnitrix. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the ultimate Ben. Ten? Or an <laughs> ultimate alien life form. That's what it is. Ben Tennyson. I can't react to that. Hi. My ability. What everyone should have known for me. Wait. Uh, wow. I wanted to pause. I wanted to be like, all right, what's her ability going to be? But you, said you said before, this though. before anyway. I said this. I'm the, the ultimate, ultimate detective. detective. Whip, whip, whip. Who would have guessed, guys? Did everybody in the comments know? Did did you guess? Could you have guessed that the person guess? who touched bodies and was really comfortable with, you know, detection and, and observation and, and, and touching, touching bodies. bodies is the ultimate detective? Right. I would have guessed she's like the ultimate coroner, but like, anyway. And the reason the I came to Hope's point? Peak. What? No, personally, personally I would have never Personally, I prefer your there. ass. If you know that reference, type four in the comments. Dude. That that doesn't mean anything anymore. There's there's two times in this episode that you said to type four. We're not gonna know. No, which that one. was type the last five. episode. Every episode, I, I say type four for something. <laughs> Dude, my entire if this is, this becomes like the biggest series on my channel and stuff like that. No, okay, right? let me reiterate. It's gonna type, it's gonna, it's type, gonna correlate. And people are just typing four type just for the meme of the it. The number four, but also leave a genuine comment. <laughs> leave, type the number four, but spell it out like F O U R, and then <laughs> You're say. Spell it wrong. And then afterwards, say what's my your favorite my favorite your favorite characteristic about me is yeah, who, make my make my day. Who's your favorite My Hero Academia character? Personally, mine's Naruto. Oh my god, because he can you, do like the lie. Omni tricks and fly like a Saiyan. Respectfully, any viewer that comments what their favorite My Hero Academia character is, I could shadow ban you from my YouTube <laughs> account. <laughs> I like um, my favorite person is um, what's his name. He's the guy with the, who looks like Deadpool twice. I like that guy. I don't know. I don't know. I haven't watched My Hero Academia. I've I've been inside of a vagina, so that's like immediately Dude, you're cuts so me out cringe. of the race. You're playing Dang and Rafa, and you're claiming that you fucking loser. Oh so, yeah, <laughs> Dang and Rafa is way better than My Hero Academia, 100. percent I would argue. I would argue the Dang and Rafa. Uh, well, okay. So I'm not like. I gotta be careful with my words. <laughs> okay, no, if you if you know the Danganronpa Phantom, the the, the Danganronpa 
fandom, you know what I'm talking about. You know that side of the fandom. I'd argue that side of the fandom is either just as bad or e equally as bad or worse than the My Hero Academia fandom. And if you're, really? if you like Danganronpa well, as much as niche. I am, you know what I'm talking about. It's more niche though, right? Because I haven't heard about this, but everyone's heard of My Hero Academia. It is a little more niche, but that's why it can get worse. Because it's yeah, echo chamber. Mm-hmm. It's like, oh my god, Kyoko's pussy. No, but that's not oh that's god. not the type of shit they argue about. <laughs> like, if you, I, I, I don't even want to bring it up, but if you've seen like on on some of the forums about Danganronpa, because I, I looked at the subreddit for that fucking for this game. Oh, it gets so bad. It gets so bad. Anyway, it's fucked. Let's move on. Sue had to find someone who. Yep, that's Sue sentence. had to find somebody. Well. It was the headmaster of Hope's Peak Academy. The headmaster? Why did you want to find the headmaster? Because he's my father. Okay, that came out of left field. <laughs> <laughs> my father, you see, was a bad man. That's a way to rip it off from Star Wars, even though it's not technically ripped off, but damn. Dude, only Star Wars can have fathers. What the fuck, game? <laughs> Fucking damn. Wait, so he was fully willing to kill his kid. Wow. Well, in the non-canon event, I guess. It was fully fucking willing to do that. That's really weird. In other weird. words, I was separated from him as a child. As it turns out, he became the headmaster of Hope's Peak. Oh, so he does he not know? Kyoko's dad is Hope's Peak's headmaster? Yeah, thank thank God this game actually threw a twist at me that I that 100% was not able like, to be called. They, yeah, they gave no fucking clues to it. Like all the other all the other like stuff I was like, okay, I could have come to that conclusion if I looked at it a little bit harder or if I thought about it a different way. That was actually a genuine twist. I'm actually pretty happy about that. And that explains when when Alter Ego told us when he thought the headmaster was involved. I... I'll find a way. Huh? Huh? I... No matter what it takes, I will, I will find the headmaster. No I don't know why I did that. No matter the cost. Oh, that's fucking way fucking so, back. Um... Kyoko, what the fuck is going on? What's going on? I, I think I should just start like flying away on a motorcycle. <laughs> What's going on? <laughs> uh, it's an invisible one. My oh fuck! Uh, my memory hadn't come back to, at that point, but when he said that, I felt strange. It makes perfect sense now. Of course, since my whole purpose for coming here was to find him. That makes sense. However, but listen, Makoto, I want to make this perfectly clear, so there's no misunderstanding. I said the headmaster wasn't the mastermind, but I didn't say that to protect him. I only said what I felt based on what I'd seen when I'd snuck into the headmaster's room. Then what did you see in there? So... The room had been... The room had been ransacked. The dusts were a mess. The sh sh desk drawers dumped on the floor. Sorry. <laughs> the only conclusion is that someone who didn't know were anything had been in where anything was had been in there you mean the mastermind right it's true that was my assumption yes and to confirm my suspicion i decided to investigate the second floor of the dorms using the key i'd found but why there because i also found this in the headmaster's room is this some kind of Indeed. map it's a layout of the entirety of hope speak academy I found it in the headmaster's room along with Mukuro's profile and that key. The map showed the second floor was home to a number of rooms meant for faculty use. Some of the staff must have had to stay overnight from time to time. And I figured the headmaster would have some kind of private room there. I assumed that if that were true, that room would likely hold more clues. So I went to check. Correct. And that's when I finally remembered. I remembered what my purpose was, to find the owner of that room. Oh, so when you went there to see if the headmaster really did have a private room there... But once I got there, I only noticed that the second floor of the dorms didn't have any cameras or monitors. Kinda wanna see what else she says. Which is why I had no I idea what was going on in the rest of the building. It has to do with Mukuro Ikusabi, However, doesn't it? Just to be perfectly clear, I didn't kill her. And I know it wasn't you either. I know you're right, but that just means everyone but you and me had an alibi. 
So then anyway, who did kill her? What I can say for sure is that the mastermind is directly involved. To begin with, the point of the class trial of Mukuro Ikusaba was to get me killed. Get you killed? Indeed. I stole that key and disappeared. And in retaliation, they wanted to draw out and eliminate me. Correct. That was the point of this class trial. It was? The mastermind knew that they couldn't interfere, to indir interfere directly. You mean because of the school regulations? That's Exactly. Right. Elementary, dear Watson, precisely. With minimal restrictions, you, you are free to explore Hope's Peak Academy at your discretion. In other words... The mastermind is adamant about following the rules, and with that rule in place, they couldn't step in. Since they couldn't kill me... Uh, sorry, since they couldn't kill me themselves, they tried to use the class trial to do it. The mastermind couldn't step in because of the rules? That makes it sound like the mastermind themselves is somehow bound by the school hey. regulations. There's one other thing I'd like to point out about the murder of Mukuro Ikusaba. What's that? There was a point where Mukuro may have not become the victim. It could have been you, Makoto. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh yeah, because they wanted to kill- Oh shit. Oh fuck! Oh, that makes oh, sense. Oh shit, oh fuck! Oh god damn shit, oh fucking- Oh, oh fuck! Oh, oh damn. Oh, pfft. oh pfft. There was a point where Mukuro- Oh right, I read that. Maybe. I could have become the victim. You know what I'm talking about, right? You mean when you had that wet dream and I pissed all over you to mark my territory during the night? I I can hear them, you know. The footsteps of the god of death, the what Shinigami. The fuck? I have the death Shinigami? note. I'm writing your name, Makoto. <laughs> Goodbye. Makoto Niyagi. Gods of How do you death. Spell the last name. <laughs> god, gods of death love apples. <laughs> I can hear the gods of death. I can death hear the gods of death draw near. That ability naturally draws me into cases just like this. What the fuck is this game, dude? Anyway. Which is exactly what happened it'll with be, you. It'll be na it'll be natural fucking dialogue, like normal fucking high schooler talking and saying like, your eyes speak of the deception that you cause against humanity. And it's like, what the <laughs> fuck are you talking about? Like, where does that come from, bro? Bro, who starts a conversation like that? I just sat down. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't make any sense. Like, she hears the whispers of the god of death. It's like... I am. Is that just a really I fucking edgy way to say you have a really good intuition? I was in the dorms and I had a sudden sense of dread. I looked down the stairwell and I saw a white shadow cross the corridor. I gave chase right away. As I followed it, I saw the shadow go into your room. Correct. I ran into your room and I saw what was happening. I intervened immediately, That's not of the course. Mastermind. However, well, that's not that's not her. That wasn't the, the end don't. of things, of course. I stopped them, but that led to uh, me pissing all over your bed. I'm sorry about that. Uh, whoever the masked assailant was, they ended up dead. Sorry, correct. just trying to keep the continuity correct. And their murder was disguised, and the dojo key wound up in my room. It was all, it all has to be the work of the mastermind in an attempt to use the class trial to eliminate me. If all that is really true. And I was that was right to not expose Kyoko's lie. I'm glad I, fi I put yeah, my face in Yeah, about that one, Kyoko Mo. <laughs> uh, Kyoko Moto. And their oh wait, uh, and their murder was disguised, and the dojo was. Oh, this is, oh yeah. Oops, sorry. You're fine. Yeah, I didn't realize I was reading the same text. Yeah, yeah, my bad. Correct. And their murder was, and it was sure the work of the. I'm sorry. That was that was my mistake. I can I can fix it. Hold on. My bad. Correct. And their murder was disguised in the dojo. Next time on Danganronpa, we're gonna get through this. <laughs> we'll find out what the work of the mastermind is next time. Goodbye. I'm sorry to cut it off short. 41 minutes. <laughs> Whee! <laughs>